Welcome back, everyone. We are in April, and it's a, a nice, cool, cool day. Not too bad. Uh, a little bit better than the weather we've been having recently. Um, we are off. We got a pile of stuff to do, as usual. And some changes that are on the way as well. So, um, this field here is ready to be drilled with something. And that field there is waiting for us to harvest um, so that we can um, merge the two fields. But before we do that, uh, I have to head off uh, and uh, we've got a field over, uh, way over, that we bought that's got canola in it. I need it for mineral feed production. So we're going to go do that and then sell the sell that field we don't really need it i did purchase another field and we'll get into that a little bit later uh, but for now let's let's go get that canola i did turn off traffic in the previous episode that will stay off now so i've made a decision with regards to the mineral feed options i've been talking about Trying to figure out how to get a, a production that does loose, loose product um, instead of the pallets, and I decided to uh, stay as is. Um, instead, change something else. Uh, instead of the, using a forklift, where are we? This is a big map. Doesn't seem like it. I've been driving for a while. Um, yeah, so. Um, instead of using a forklift to pick up all the parrots, I'm just gonna... Parrots. Pallets. Um, okay, this is the field here. I don't know how to get to it. Um... I assume that they're... I don't know, it's probably up there somewhere. Oh, turning around with a... header trailer on is not much fun. How about we just cut through the hedge? Yeah, we'll do that. Alright. Uh, let's get this set up and going and I'll show you what else we're doing. Okay, we're off. Let's jump back to the farm. I'll keep blabbing when we're there. So we have this uh, trailer here that we use for just hauling small stuff around, pallets and whatnot, and bought a forklift a little while back, uh, traded in a tractor, got a forklift uh, with hopes to move the pallets, but these things are coming out fast, as, and like, I can't keep up with them at all. Uh, so what we're going to do is uh, I'm going to sell the forklift, sell this trailer, get the exact same trailer but with the auto load feature and we'll use auto loading for for mineral feed and our eggs that's still those are the only things that we need uh you know pallet management for so that's what we're gonna do and then i'm gonna get caught up with the with the mineral feed because <laughs> as fast as i try to move it it pops up again non-stop and it's only 1,000 uh, liters at a time which is it's it just takes a while it takes a while uh, what else did I change I changed quite a few things um, as I mentioned earlier in the series I will be doing stuff off camera uh, I did sell the uh, the Voltra uh, tractor uh, and a couple of other things I forget um, but I leased another Fent uh, 1050 this time. A big, big boy. So, um, yeah, we've got two, you know, fairly big tractors now. Uh, we're probably going to be needing a third uh, very soon. And, uh, you know, we'll get on that. I still have a weight here. Why do I have a weight here? Let's pick that up and bring it back. We might need it. There we go. Oops.
Uh, actually, let's sell that first. It's strapped on. I don't know what's going to happen. Might launch it into the sky. Okay, and we will buy... Uh, we're going to go down here. Uh, it's not in miscellaneous. It's in low loaders. Uh, the exact same one, but this one has auto load features on it. So that's going to take care of our problem, really. Now, I had sold the roller. Uh, I didn't quite understand how it worked, so I sold it. Uh, I did some testing off on another map, and I really should have kept it. So we might rebuy it um, now that I understand when to use it and how to use it. So, let's get this mineral feed done. We'll get that sorted out, and then we're going to move on to... Uh, we're going to have to get a... A trailer over. Uh, where are we at? 32%. Um, yeah, we'll have to get a trailer over there. Then start unloading, bringing it back to the farm. Uh, we're going to have to buy a bigger, bigger trailer, bigger, and probably a road truck uh, to help with shipping stuff back and forth. We're getting into volumes now, so. Okay. Let's see how this goes. This is going to be a lot easier. I'm also going to do something else here while we're here. Okay. Got a load. Nice. I'm going to get over a little bit closer. See what I mean? Like they just keep popping out. There's going to be another five that are going to pop out any second. Um, while we're waiting on that, I'm doing something else here. And we are going to sell this shed. We're freeing up more room. Oh, and we are full. So I'm going to take this first load over to uh, the main uh, cattle farm, I guess. Uh, then we're going to load the rest. Don't, don't go over that. Okay. That's 20,000 in one shot. Way easier. Uh, let's unlock all that before it starts freaking out. There we go. There we go. Uh, there's only three of them now, so we're caught up. That, that's, you know, that's a huge difference. Yeah, I sold that shed because um, I want more room. I want more yard space. Uh, I am maybe not even done yet. Uh, this this silo here does that underground sharing thing um, and I want to solve that problem at some point so I may build a new silo somewhere else to detach it from everything oops don't forget I had the weight on there oh boy there we go okay that should make things a lot easier um, we are going to look at upgrading our drill in this episode. Uh, that one is going to be way too small for the size of fields we have now. I don't know if this loads bales, but we're not doing bales anyway, so it's not a big deal. Okay. Alright, that's done. Uh, let's get our trailer. Where is it? Where is the trailer? How are you guys doing today? Uh-oh. Let me jump over the harvester. It looks like it hasn't moved in a bit. Oh, 
Okay. It'll probably get stuck a few times on the on the uh, outer headland. All right, let's head over there. We'll get this ready, and then we're going to get some more work done. We got so much to do, guys. So much. Uh, it's hard to keep up. Whoops, I just ran over something. What was it? Just a bump? Bump in the road? Weird. Okay. Yeah, I guess. Uh, not in the road, but... What you get for not driving on the road. Um, let's see... There's an official way in here. That's not the field, but... There may be a road. No, there isn't. There isn't. That's a fail. I guess you have to go around the back somewhere. Eh, let's just cut through here. I think this is harvested anyway. I just gotta avoid the posts. We're at 64%, so we still got a little bit to go. And we have a clear corner. Good. All right, so uh, we are just finishing this up here. Uh, I did go in and harvest all the grass. Uh, we put it into the silage production, uh, into the fermenter. And now we're just in the process. So we're going to merge all three of these fields. So I had uh, had a worker um, automate, you know, the 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 plowing uh, and then we're going to manually plow the uh the innards i guess innards that's kind of weird isn't it this shouldn't take too long then we're going to get drilling uh, we're going to put be putting grass back in this is going to be our big hay fields I'm hoping that we have enough money soon to buy one more field that I want. Uh, kinda, I guess to complete the vision uh, of you know how we're going to operate. Um, I, I need to generate chaff. Uh, we'll do that with corn, and um, uh, I need a field to do it in. So, okay, uh, I gotta turn that on. There we go. Whoops. Love those posts. Just love them. Oops. Okay. Yeah, this shouldn't take too long. Uh, this has to be done manually. Where are we at? We're at 83%. As soon as the harvester is full, I'll jump over and finish this afterwards. Oops. Not too far over. Okay, we got this little bit here. Uh, we're going to finish that up in a minute, but our harvester is full. And our harvester is unloading itself, so I don't have anything to do here. Looks like it's going to work out fine. All right, let's continue with this work. Uh, 
I'm going to start from this side here. Uh, there might be a tricky spot here. I got to be careful. Um, there's a glitch, a bit of a glitch in the map where there's a piece of land right in that triangle there, right in the middle where all the, the three uh, grass things uh, merge. Um, that is cannot be owned. Um, you can't buy it. Like I own all all sides of this, but I cannot do certain things on one little piece there, and it's kind of gonna drive me nuts, probably. So I need to go out wide a little bit. Uh, I don't want to have a problem where I have a wonky looking field. I think that's gonna work out just fine like this. Okay. I can try to push it back little bits by little bits till I hit the spot. Uh, I just didn't want a big gouge that I couldn't fix after. Because if you, you know, sometimes you can't fix it. If you can't own it, you can't fix it. So. I guess 73,000. Uh, I'm going to need a drill, a seed drill, a bigger, much bigger one. And, um, yeah, I'm not quite sure what I'm going to get. I haven't checked to see if there's any good deals on the used market. Maybe we'll get lucky with that. I figure I need at least a eight, eight meter um, drill, if not, you know, more than that. This field, you know, this is going to be grass, so it's a seed once kind of concept, but um, there are other uh, other fields that are pretty big. I'm going to try to chip a little bit more away on this. Wish me luck. Whoa, whoa, not too much. Let's see what happens. Oh, this could be good. This could be good. I might just like it just like this. Okay. Yeah, I'm happy with it. I'm not going to mess with it anymore. We'll paint some new grass on there. Alright, guys. This is our hay field. Um, it is going to be... Um, we're going to drill it up right away. Get somebody on it. Uh, I wish I had another another tractor. I guess I could use this drill. I'm not sure. Not sure if I should. It's such a small drill. Let's have a look and see if there's anything good on the used market. Um, anything interesting? No, no, nothing that we. Oh, no, this might be interesting. Oh, that's a huge wheelbase, though. These tight corners on some, on some areas might not work. I think we'll probably have to go with a Euro-style uh, truck. Um, okay, so let me show you what I'm planning while I'm waiting here. Um, so we're working on this field right now. Canola, we're going to sell it. As soon as we sell it, uh, let's have a look. What's What's the field worth? It is worth uh, 90,000. Uh, I already have 73, so I'll have 160,000 ish, 165,000. Um, I went ahead and bought this field, which is right at our farm, um, and it is uh, ready to harvest. It is uh, wheat, uh, so we'll get a lot more straw again. And I want to follow it up by buying this field, taking down the gate here um the 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 hedge and and whatnot and uh harvesting plowing the whole thing together as one field and using this as a corn field to uh generate our chaff uh, which is going to go right here um that you know so it's very convenient to drop it off here so i think that's what we're going to do um this is ready to harvest this one there is ready to harvest this one is almost ready. The problem with this one, though, is it is uh, potatoes. And I don't want to do that. 
I don't want to do potatoes. So we're probably just going to plow it out. Uh, to buy this field is 60. Oh, I can buy it right now. Yeah, why not? Let's do it. Okay. I didn't want to wait another few months. I want to get this done. Um, I could have waited to see if, you know, something else got drilled in here. But, you know, let's just go fast, I guess. All right. So I have 7,000. I guess I better get uh, selling that other property. Now, this is going to be a bad place to be parked. Let's jump over. While we're here, why don't we see if we can find... There's the entrance right there, right at the end. Okay. I did not see it before. This shouldn't take much longer. This harvester goes, goes pretty good. Uh, let's check our status on, um, we are, we, I don't remember if we're doing weeds on this series. I don't think we are. Um, perhaps we are. I'm not sure. Uh, but, uh, fertilization, uh, this needs lime so we could get that done. Uh, these will need lime and, uh, they won't need plowing. So that's okay. That's good. Uh, we still have to drill something in here. We have to drill this and we have to harvest, join, and drill this again. So yeah, can you see? Can you see how much work we have to do? Um, yeah. I, I really kind of feel like I need another tractor now, don't I? Uh, perhaps another harvester, really. Okay, let's deal with the drill issue. Um, I think we're just gonna, I think we're just gonna drill with this guy for now. I know I might regret it. It might be taking way too long. This is, um, this is only six meters, but it is a direct drill and it does fertilize. Oh no, it does not fertilize. Ooh, okay. Hmm. Hmm, and I have no money. What to do? What to do next? Okay, so here's what we'll do. Uh, we're going to continue uh, generating oats. So I'm going to plant the... Uh, run the seed drill um, down on the smaller field over here. This This drill should be fine. Tractor is a little bit overpowered for this drill, but that's okay. We, we do need a third tractor now. It's pretty much obvious. Um, all right, so we want, uh, I want to continue with oats for the horses. Um, we need a coarse, sharp. Let's get that going. We're going to have to fertilize this. I uh, probably should have done it first, but that's okay. While we're waiting on that, let's have a look at seed drills. What could we get that would be a decent size? Um, we can easily handle this. This is 8 meters. Uh, this is 12. Uh, it does not fertilize. It is not a direct drill. That's kind of the problem with this one. Uh, but it doesn't need much horsepower. So... I'm not sure that that's a good option for us. Um, this is eight meters. It is a direct drill and it, fer and it um, fertilizes as well. So that might be a good option, but I kind of feel like we should probably go even bigger than that. Uh, what else do I have in here? Uh, this is nine. Is a direct drill and fertilizes. I, I have used this. Uh, I'm actually using this on Corpy now. Uh, it's a great drill. And I want a symmetrical drill, so I, I won't go with anything like this because this is going to be an offset and uh, it, it'll be an offset and um, horse play is going to be a little bit more difficult to work that. What is this? This is 12.8. It does direct drill, no fertilizing. Uh, it's expensive though. 
Hmm. Hmm. What about this guy? 230, it's not a direct drill. Um, does not fertilize. Yeah. Yeah, I don't quite know which our next step is. I feel that we're probably going to be going for uh, something like this. I'll just have to fertilize separately. Uh, eight meters. Price is reasonable. I could go with this. This is not a direct drill, though, so I'll have to cultivate first. But that is 15 meters. That's a big drill. See, the problem with big drills is that they don't, um, they are difficult to um, do precision with. Uh, so lots of stuff gets left behind. The smaller the drill, the more detail, you know, precision uh, you can get. But at the same, you know, that's a, there's a trade off there as far as time it takes to get stuff done. Okay, what are the chances that all of this is going to fit in the trailer? Oh no, I'm out of money. Oh. Okay, I guess the other guy stopped too. Um, yeah, alright. Let's see if we can get this done manually then. Guess we'll have to sell something. Uh, I think we're maxed out on our loans. Are we maxed out? We are not maxed out. Borrow a little bit more. I guess as you, um, yeah, I guess as you own more and more land, the, the bank's willing to give you more money. So, we are definitely growing, that's for sure. Let's go restart the other one. I'm sure that stopped too. Okay, we're off. So what do you think, guys? Are we going to have enough room? My bet is no. We're going to be just short. stopped okay oh oh guys we might get lucky here matter of fact I think it's gonna fit right on Sweet. Okay, let's get this into our, our production, and then we're going to have to come back, get the harvester, and head off to the next field to harvest. Whoops, I missed my turn. Missed the turn. I need to clean up those corners, too. Okay, let's get this unloaded. And while we're doing that, let's look at the production, see how we're doing here. Yeah, we're going to be in great shape for a little while. Fantastic. I don't know if it's a one-to-one. -one. Yeah, it is kind of a one-to-one. -one. So these are actually almost spot on. Yeah, they are <laughs> almost perfect. Perfect. Okay, so that's going to keep us going for a little while. Um, all right, let's go get our harvester. There we go. We should probably fold this while we're traveling. Uh, 
Okay. Take the proper proper road out of here. Actually, while we're here, let us let us sell that field right away before I forget. Uh, farmland. There we go. Sell. Okay. We're back in the money. We still don't have enough for a big seed drill, though. Yeah, we'll have to figure that out. We may sell... What is it? It's April. I was going to say, we may sell the wheat that we harvest. Um, we've got a small soybean field that's going to come up. That's got to come up today. This month, anyway. But the uh, top, top price is June for that, I think. Hmm. Yeah, money making. I could flip more fields, I guess. <laughs> Starting to get a little tired of that, to be honest. Maybe there's a production that we could stand up that would be a money maker for us, get our cash flow going. Not quite sure what I would do. Um, we don't necessarily have a use for manure uh, at this point. I mean, we could use it and spread it. Uh, or I could turn around and s either sell it or turn it on a production. Um, yeah, actually, you know what? Let me just double check something. Uh, biogas plant. Oh, cannot be bought. Okay. So if we wanted to do the biogas thing, uh, we would have to stand up our own. Biogas plants are always good money makers. I do tend to use it more than but than I'd like to. Um, I have a few go-tos for m making money, and uh, I don't want to be keep repeating it all the time, you know. Okay, here we are. This is the field we're going to... Uh, not this one. Oops. I nearly hit a pole there. This field here, it's a smallish field. Uh, we'll get that harvested next. That's the soybean. I think we're just going to pop that right into the uh, into the silo and wait till June to sell it. This is going to be a very fast harvest. And it's... I don't even think I'm going to need a trailer. And drop off this trailer here. And I'm gonna put the weight down somewhere. Somewhere. Probably over here, where I tend to leave the weights. Uh, what do we have loaded in this guy? Is it fertilizer or herbicide? It's fertilizer. Okay, so I think what I'm gonna do... Uh, this field here needs fertilizing. And we have to fertilize in these rows here. Um, so I think we'll set set them up on this one. Since I don't think we're going to get a direct drill, I think we're going to have to do it the old uh, old fashioned way, I guess. I don't know if it's old fashioned. I'm just making up words. Um, yeah, maybe we'll get into that. We'll get a, a cultivator and. Um, do the whole kit. Off we go. And we're fertilizing. Good. This will also need fertilizing. These little lines in here, this and this field one once we're done. We're actually going to jump in here, get this done manually. It's just, it's just such a small field. All right, almost done. There we go. Only 8,500. That's not a lot. Oh, 
I'm not going to fold the pipe yet, so I'm going to try to unload directly into the silo. We've got 97,000. Um, we do need to make some money. Um, right now we're, we're almost at a stall point. Um, so I either have to flip some more fields or see how generous the bank wants to be uh, to help us continue building. Well, this is going to work. Oh, it's going to be tight. Never mind. There we go. Yeah, we'll have to see. I've been focusing on developing the farm a little bit lately and haven't, you know, been in money making mode. All right. Oh, I don't know where I'm holding. I gotta keep working with this guy. Actually, that's probably going to go into next episode, but uh, let's get over there. Maybe we'll get started. This is our field right here. So I'm going to get this started, and um, then we're going to... I'm going to clean up some more hedges. Um, I kind of have a, I want to call it a rule, but uh, basically if I own fields on both sides of the, 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 the fence or the hedge, um, I'm okay. I, I feel okay with taking it down. Um, if it borders onto somebody else's property, uh, somebody else's piece of land, then I, I don't want to do that. Um, yeah, I don't know. Call that a little bit of role play, but... Um, sharp. You know what? Let's do it smooth. Okay, let's go. More harvesting. Okay, and need to fertilize here later, but we'll do that. Uh, we'll do that again later. Let's do a quick check on our on our cows, though, uh, while we're here. Uh, where are we at with this? We are out of silage again and out of food again. Oh goodness! Goodness! Oh boy! And my tractors... Oh, no, there's one. I'm sure I have the silage now, though. Yeah, we really need a bigger trailer. I got 382,000 liters of grass still to process. And only this much silage so far. I mean, it was this month that, that I harvested it, so it hasn't had much time yet to the process. We'll grab everything that we have here, though, and dump it. Still haven't started our dairy cows, although I have been dropping uh, some materials into that uh, barn uh, slowly uh, so that we don't have too much... Too much of a shock uh, when we try to get started. Yeah. Okay. Village. We need massive amounts of it. You know, as far as the animals are, themselves are concerned, uh, we have they have they started reproducing? Not yet. They have not started yet. Uh, puberty, puberty, uh, reproduction. Uh, so this batch here of sixty will reproduce uh, pretty soon. Uh, these guys here will be ready to start um, producing soon. 
So. Yep. Okay, let's go get the rest. We'll fill that up. Make our little robot buddy work. Okay, so we now have... We're going to have almost 70,000. Uh, we've got lots of mineral feed. 30,000 liters of mineral feed. That's going to keep us for a little bit. And hay is good. Uh, got lots of slurry in there. Uh, maybe I need to put up a BGA. Okay. Alright, that's done. I made some good progress. Made some really good progress. Um, still, as you can see, tons to do. And I just realized that my... Mister is full already. Oh boy. Yeah, tons to do. So we're just going to carry on with this. Uh, we're going to have a lot of straw to pick up here. And I hope I can get at this corner properly. Oh, it's going to be too close. No. There we go. Um, yeah, so we're going to get going with this and um, get all this harvested, get the straw picked up, get this um, plowed. We're going to take down the hedge and we're going to probably just plow in uh, the potatoes. I don't want them. I uh, don't want to go through that hassle. And uh, then we'll merge, we'll start the process of merging the fields. Uh, we have, our, our biggest challenge now is a, a decent sized seed drill, uh, which is a problem. So we're going to have to figure that out. I need to figure out how to get some more money too. I'm curious to see how much the bank would be willing to give us, but I'm not sure. <laughs> Alright guys, thanks for watching. I hope you're enjoying this series. And uh, can I get through here? trying to get out of the way um if you are if you are enjoying this please consider subscribing and um i really hope you have a great day